Welcome back to the Pantry Prepper. I am taking you on, I guess, an experiment. We're trying to see what it did. We planted our, not planted, we stored our potatoes from last July, some of them, we went through all of them, in different places. Okay, so the first place we put them, this is the first place, it's out in the woods. So, let's see what they look like. Let me see. Oh, ants gotten into them. That's bad. Look. Oh, you stupid ants. All of them? But they're still good, though. I mean. But they're good. Look at them. The ants. The ants. This one's not bad. This one the ants haven't got. We could use this to plant or eat. This is still good. Yeah, green. If I put them here. You can plant that one. Yep. Plant that one. Buried in hay. And we've had a cold one. Yeah, well, it did help that we had a colder winter than normal. And a hot summer. And a hot summer. But, y'all, these potatoes have lasted that long. So this has, like, been a really good experiment. Annabelle be like, good. I mean, so incredibly good. It was the last of the potatoes that we stored in the hay box. And... Y'all, they look absolutely amazing. This is blowing my mind. Oh, you just hate Annabelle now. <laughs> Do what? You just hate Annabelle. Talking about you. But these look really good so far. These were the ones that were buried in pine straw. We lost more of them. Definitely because they were in the ground because of ants. That's a huge thing to consider. But these were in the box right here with hay. Yeah, so that's not, we could have done a whole lot more, but honestly, we ate quite a few and I put a bunch in the freezer already made up. Yeah, out of here one time. Oh yeah, we did pull a bunch out just, well, yeah, to eat. I made a bunch of freezer potatoes. So yeah, this is definitely a way to store them. Laying box for the chickens. A laying box, yeah, you better shut that back up or they'll go in there. They'll start laying again. I don't want them to go in there. What was this originally? We used to feed the dogs. Oh. We used to keep dog food under here. Oh, yeah, it was a shelter. There's there's one. There's a potato right there. Cannot lose one. So, definitely, is this a go-to a go -to again this year with our potatoes? No. The box is going to have to be bigger. Yeah, the big one's bigger. The big is going to have to be bigger. Lord willing, we get a bunch of potatoes. But these potatoes, they're, they're not even, they're not even that, Richard, they're not even that soft. And it's time for them to start sprouting because it's the middle of May. We planted these in the middle of, excuse me, middle of March. We planted these in March last year. So definitely, here we go. The hay, excuse me, the inside the ground with the pine straw. No, because of the ants. Ants are bad. This worked really well. The ants could have got into this though, couldn't they? Yeah, they the could have, but chickens, they didn't. The chickens were under here a lot. The chickens, yeah, the chickens are constantly down yeah. scratching and stuff. Here, so that's a good thing. Yeah, that was a good thing. That probably kept them from making ant piles. So most of the ant piles around here are out in the open. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, definitely, this is a good way to store the potatoes. And we are going to plant these. Or, I don't know, actually, I kind of want to eat some. Last of our so-called fresh potatoes, right? What you think? I'll kind of do them to see how they do. I definitely want to do that. So, was this a good thing? So far. Yep, it's better than what we've been doing. I mean, they've lasted. Like I said, they were planted in March of 2020. It is now March. They were pulled in July of 2020. And it is now the middle of March 2021. Yeah, and that, this is for southeastern North Carolina where we have horrible, hot, humid summers. I think this is really good, y'all. This is done. This is beautiful. Anyway, I hope something here helped you. It's just a box filled with hay. He had it. What? You had it boarded up with screws and stuff? Yeah, just plywood around it. Yeah, good job. Old scrap pieces of plywood. Yep, well, everything we do around here is scrap. Use what you got, people. <laughs> Don't throw anything away. You can always find a use for it. Anyway, hope you guys are having an awesome day. Good way to store your potatoes. Definitely going to do it again this year. Lord willing, if we get enough potatoes. Yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. God bless.